Teenage means you're slowly getting poisoned by your hormones. Old age means you're being released from that. <laughs> so those of you who are in middle age have no clue where the hell you are. <laughs> so don't deal with your teenagers. Please uh, make yourself available to be dealt by them. Make them responsible for everything. I'm telling you, one month you have the courage to hand over your monthly income to them and say, manage the house. Just give them responsibility. You will see dramatically it will change. If you want to really do something with your children, you must allow them to expand because that's all they're trying to do. Their body is not the only thing that's growing. The potential of being human being is growing, you must allow them to expand. Instead of that, you're seeing how to constrict them, then you will have a huge problem. If you have boys, you will have one kind of problem. If you have girls, you will have another kind of problem. You think restriction is a good way of controlling life, no. Responsibility will put them on the track. Hand over your money to them and tell them, this month you're on vacation, you handle this, whichever way. You're afraid, maybe he'll go and blow it up, what'll happen tomorrow? If he blows it up, what happens to you will happen to him also. Let him go through it for a month. <laughs> of course you can keep some reserve, but let him understand if he blows it up tomorrow morning, there'll be no breakfast. And let him go through that, what's the problem? Let him understand, that's the way it is. It's better to learn in a protected, caring atmosphere than out on the street tomorrow morning, isn't it? <laughs> and above all, above all, drop this damn thing that your child belongs to you. Another life does not belong to you. If another life has chosen to be with you, please cherish that. It's a tremendous thing. Whether it's your husband or your wife or your children, they don't belong to you. You don't own them in any sense. If you don't get it, you will understand when you die or they die. They don't belong to you. Another life has chosen to come through you or be with you. Cherish that, value that. Don't think you're the owner of this life. You're not. They're just telling you, you don't own me. As a hu another human being, you think they don't want to be included? They definitely want to be included. So, teenage means there are many things. Because one thing is, your intelligence is being hijacked by your hormones. So certain things are happening. Suddenly the world doesn't look the same. If you were a good friend, if they had problems, if they had struggles, they would talk to you. It is best if your child has a problem, they come to you, isn't it? Yes, but they will not come to you if you are a boss. They will not come to you if you have ownership over that life. They will not come to you if you are that horrible father or mother. They will come to you if you are a good friend, because when they have problems, it is natural for them to seek a friend. So make sure from an early age that you are their best friend. Till they reach eighteen, twenty, you are their best friend. Make it that way and this you have to earn, this will not drop because you delivered them. Because you delivered them, you get the title of mother and father. You will not get the title of a friend. This has to be earned and everyday responsible behavior from you.